Hello once again, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Lenari here as always. Welcome back. We're gonna go talk to the guy that invented the translator. Maybe he could upgrade it for... I mean, I don't know if he... I don't think he can, considering this is something that's never been seen before, but, like, I've been looking at the translation stuff. Or, like, the, uh, the writings. So maybe this machine gathers of, like, unable to translate will hold for future reference or something. Like, you know? Maybe it's doing something like that. Pretty sure he's at the observatory. What's up, dudes? Ha! Can you help me translate this new alien language I found? A new language? Yes, absolutely. Stars above you bet I can. Just give me, let's call it a hundred samples, some form of epigraphical codex in six months. I should have the vague gist of the sort of graphemes this new language is working with. Gosh, I can't wait to get started. Oh. Look at this, it's such open size. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, you're no help. God damn it. It was an idea. I knew it was a long shot. Oh my god, the music in this game. I don't think I'll ever get tired of it. You have anything to say to me? Enormous reservoir with wooden piers and buildings on both shores. Shores. A slide reel that shows a strange vault being encased in a large metal structure and lowered underwater. Nearly all of the, of the slides have been burned and cannot be viewed. A large metal structure is suspended by chains. It can be entered by swimming from below. There is a sealed vault illuminated by a green fire inside the structure. Yeah. What I thought. We're going to go pick up our weird gun thing, and we're going to head straight to the reservoir, to that building that lowered the, the thing. Probably nowhere close to being able to use that gun thing, but I don't want to accidentally miss my opportunity to use it, right? 
Plus it's not hurting me to carrying it around, so. So, I've been wondering, from the outside of this thing, there's no, there's none of these giant windows, right? Like, it looks like it's metal from the outside, but when you get in here, it's see-through. In fact, that's the cage you can see, like, that's like on the outside, that deploys the fans or whatever. The uh, iris, if you want to call it. But from the outside, it just looks like it's metal. Like, you can't see into here, you can only see out. So how's the light getting in? From the sun. I guess it's like a one-way metal tubing, right? Oh shit, no, go that way, go that way. I saw a thing, I want to check this other side here. See, you can see something there. place. It's going to take a while to explore, I think. It's like their version of a hanging city. <laughs> so hold on. There's ghost matter here, right? So that means they didn't come here after the Nomai died. They, they were he This was here when the Nomai were here. So, I don't know if these guys were alive when the Nomai were here, but the Nomai could have found this place, but they never fucking did, it seems. There's no mention of it. I know this is a DLC, so like, so like, it, the developers probably didn't plan it. But canonically, the Nomai didn't even know this thing was here. So maybe these bird people were here, were a lot, no, they wouldn't be here when the ghost matter showed up. Oh god, more creepy shit incoming. Because there's no- their bodies aren't laying around. Like, you know, they were- they just suddenly died. So they were probably dead before the ghost matter got here. More of this stuff. Maybe they ritualistically killed themselves? Yeah, I'm not seeing, like, a way I can, like, interact. This stuff, so... I do wonder, though... That's the only one that opens up. Okay. Okay. This is 
looking like another theater area. Okay, there's a few slides here. Okay. We'll go back, get a lantern, and check these slides out. I wonder if you ever can translate the their 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 language. Honestly, so far I am loving this DLC. It's so cool. It's such a change. Between you and me, I kind of like these deer bird people's aesthetic a bit more than the Nomai. The Nomai stuff is cool. It's just visually I'm kind of into this more, to be honest. I'm a big fan of like wooden furniture and stuff. Okay, that's the third chain. Okay, this has to do with their s the symbols are important. Obviously, the symbols are important. Oh, this looks like it's going to show me about the gun. That looks like the gun, right? This is them in our, in our system. They're missing home. They after missing home, they all come in here with the lanterns, hold it up, and close their eyes. And then the thing travels in there, and they're like sleeping. They they just never woke up. That's interesting. That'll just take us back down. You know, let's let's make sure we don't miss anything. Just go all the way down there. If there's nothing down there, we'll just come back up. Looks like the fire went in this thing here, and then they went to sleep. Because he was still breathing after the fire went in. Okay.
It's this place. Oh, this place doesn't look good. Another place where they were worshipping the eye. Hold on. Is this about telling a story? God damn it. I want to say this is about a story. So there's the eye of the universe, then they're home, then they come home, and I don't know what that means. The fire. Maybe? I don't know. That's the only thing I can think of is that it's a, we're supposed to tell a sequen sequence of events. Maybe the other way? still say the same. Sure, I gotta learn more. How much damage has this done? Quite a bit, it seems. Not too much. Yeah, let's check these buildings down here. Oh, I see. I gotta be more preemptive on it. There we go. A 
another ring thing. Yeah, see, this is like a bed for them. An interesting picture of them playing a board game. How nice. It was good to play games when you're having a stressful situation. Get your mind off of all the bad stuff. By bad stuff, I mean like the eye turning out to be possibly evil. It drove these guys to be mad, that's for sure. Alright, this looks like it's about the ring world. Just from that symbol there. Something's wrong on the outside. I mean, the top left pillar with this one at the bottom. Okay. Top left pillar. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. We'll have to check that out on the next loop just so we have time. Can I make the jump? over there. Can I make that? I don't know if I explored that building. Ooh, yes I can. So there's the lanterns, and then there's that one, but that doesn't have the thing on the front, but that one does. No way I can... dumps us out here. That's just going to put us back in the river. See, there's one of the things down there, too. Okay, so there's a way I can conceal it and focus it. So maybe that's how I can I can get the fire in there and then f focus the beam on faraway things. But how would I get? How do I get the fire in there? Hmm. That thing did shoot out flames so maybe that's how I can get fire I do still need to explore that building there I'm just gonna go for a boat ride. There's not much I can do with the time left. Maybe there's stuff I can do on the dam too on top. Oh, 
Where's the big boom? I am kind of sad you don't hear the explosion, like the supernova, and then like see. Oh, you can. I guess you can see it. You usually can hear it. it. Just kind of sneaks up on you. You see, it doesn't even hit you. You know. Well, that is all the time I have for today, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for watching, and as always. Have a lovely day.